space, the final frontier. It's a realm of vast distances, a canvas upon which the universe paints its wonders. When we gaze up at the night sky, we are greeted by a sea of stars, each a distant sun, perhaps harboring planets of their own. It's a sight that inspires dreams of exploration, of journeying to those distant shores of the cosmos. But the distances involved are staggering, far beyond anything we experience in our daily lives. Consider this, the nearest star to our sun, Proxima Centauri, is about 4.24 light years away. That means light itself, traveling at an incredible speed of 186,282 miles per second, takes over four years to complete the journey. To put that into perspective, if our fastest spacecraft, the Parker Solar Probe, were to set course for Proxima Centauri, it would take tens of thousands of years to reach its destination. The vastness of space is humbling, a constant reminder of how far we have to go before we can truly call ourselves an interstellar species. But it's also a challenge, an invitation to push the boundaries of science and engineering, to develop technologies that can conquer these cosmic distances. The dream of interstellar travel is a powerful one, and it's a dream that humanity is actively pursuing. The path to the stars is not without its obstacles, but with every challenge overcome, we inch closer to fulfilling our destiny as explorers of the cosmos. The universe awaits, and the journey promises to be nothing short of extraordinary. Our current spacecraft, marvels of engineering though they are, are simply not equipped for the rigors of interstellar travel. They rely on chemical rockets which work by burning fuel to create thrust. While this method has served us well for exploring our solar system, it falls short when we consider the vast distances between stars. Chemical rockets require enormous amounts of fuel to generate even modest amounts of thrust. This is problematic for interstellar travel, as carrying all that fuel would make spacecraft incredibly heavy, further limiting their speed and range. To escape the gravitational pull of our sun and reach even a fraction of the speed of light, a spacecraft using conventional fuel would need more propellant than there is matter in the observable universe. Clearly, a different approach is needed. Scientists and engineers are hard at work developing new propulsion systems that can propel us to the stars. These advanced technologies aim to break free from the limitations of chemical rockets, offering the potential for faster, more efficient interstellar travel. The quest for interstellar travel is, in many ways, a quest for a revolution in propulsion technology. The engines of tomorrow will need to be powerful enough to shorten journey times, efficient enough to make those journeys feasible, and reliable enough to ensure the safety of those who dare to venture into the cosmos. Interstellar travel is not just about covering vast distances, it's also about overcoming the immense energy barrier that separates us from the stars. Accelerating a spacecraft to even a fraction of the speed of light requires an almost unimaginable amount of energy. To put it into perspective, consider that the total energy consumption of the entire human civilization in a year is dwarfed by the energy needed to propel a spacecraft to the stars. Traditional energy sources like fossil fuels or even nuclear fission are simply not efficient enough for interstellar travel. They produce relatively small amounts of energy for their mass, making them impractical for powering spacecraft on such long journeys. We need a fundamentally different approach to energy generation, one that can unlock the incredible power hidden within the very fabric of space and time. Scientists are exploring a range of exotic energy sources that could potentially fuel interstellar missions. These include antimatter annihilation, which releases energy with unparalleled efficiency, and fusion power, the same process that powers the stars themselves. Harnessing these forces of nature could provide us with the energy we need to reach the stars. Section 4. Time's Unfamiliar Song, Dilation in the Deep One of the most intriguing aspects of interstellar travel is the concept of time dilation, a consequence of Einstein's theory of special relativity. As an object approaches the speed of light, time itself begins to slow down relative to observers who are stationary or moving at slower speeds. This means that time would pass differently for astronauts on a high-speed interstellar journey compared to people back on Earth. For example, if a spacecraft were to travel to a star system 10 light years away at a significant fraction of the speed of light, decades might pass for those on Earth while only a few years would pass for the crew aboard the ship. This time dilation effect has profound implications for interstellar travel, raising intriguing possibilities for generational ships and the future of human exploration. 
Time dilation is a mind-bending concept, a reminder that the universe operates by rules that often defy our everyday intuition. It's a phenomenon that highlights the truly extraordinary nature of interstellar travel, where the boundaries of space and time become blurred. Section 5. A universe of fuel solving the supply problem. The vast distances of interstellar space pose a significant logistical challenge. How do we carry enough fuel to power a spacecraft on such a long journey? Traditional rocket fuel is bulky and inefficient, and carrying enough of it for interstellar travel would make the spacecraft prohibitively heavy. To overcome this hurdle, scientists are exploring innovative solutions that could provide a more sustainable and efficient means of propulsion. One such concept is the Bussard Ramjet, a hypothetical spacecraft that uses a powerful magnetic field to collect hydrogen from the interstellar medium, essentially scooping up fuel as it travels through space. This eliminates the need to carry all of the fuel from Earth, significantly reducing the spacecraft's mass and increasing its potential range. Another possibility is to beam energy to the spacecraft wirelessly from a base station near Earth using lasers or microwaves, this would allow the spacecraft to accelerate continuously without having to carry any fuel on board, potentially enabling it to reach a significant fraction of the speed of light. Solving the fuel problem is crucial for making interstellar travel a reality, and these innovative concepts offer tantalizing glimpses into a future where humanity can venture freely among the stars.